Well, we really said that we had a situation with a prior, a test has a certain sensitivity and a certain specificity. When you receive, say, a positive test result, what you do is you take your prior, you multiply in the probability of this test result given C, and you multiply in the probability of the test result given not C. So this is your branch for the consideration that you have cancer. This is your branch for the consideration you have no cancer. When you're done with this, you arrive at a number that now combines the cancer hypothesis with the test result, both for the cancer hypothesis and the not, not cancer hypothesis. Now what you do, you add those up, and they normally don't add up to one. You get a certain quantity, which happens to be the total probability that the test is what it was, in this case positive. And all you do next is divide or normalize this thing over here by the sum over here, and the same on the right side. The divider is the same for both cases because this is your cancer branch, your non-cancer branch, but this guy doesn't depend on the cancer variable anymore. What you now get out is the desired posterior probability, and those add up to one if you did everything correct, as shown over here. This is your algorithm for a base rule.